Hi, welcome back to educate2.com. My name is Setsuki, your host. Today I'll be showing you how to build a spotlight with USB powered plug. It has a switch as well, turn off and on. Okay, so basically it can actually charge your smartphone or any USB devices. And on top of that, just like is an ordinary spotlight, right? So it's a spotlight and a USB powered device so you can plug you can plug any USB device and charge your cell phone or smartphone or whatever you want all right let's okay, get started I'll show you how to convert a spotlight this uh, this is a one a million uh, one M series spotlight it's by motor master so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take it apart and look at the battery I think I checked the spec already it's um it's a six volt battery uh, 2.5 Amp hour, so we're talking about 15 watt of power in this little thing. I bought it uh, on sale, right, for around 10, 15 bucks. Um, I think it's actually nine bucks. I'm not sure. I can check it out. You know, they they rarely come this cheap, but when it's on sale, I buy a bunch of them. Okay, so anyway, what I'm gonna do is you also need need this um, uh, device. This is a USB to car plug. It looks something like this. Now, the one I got is called Extreme. It's a dual port USB car charger. It's a rapid charge. It's, it, it claims to be uh, 2,100 milliamp hour or 2.1 amp hour power. Okay. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try to, you know, uh, drill hole and put this inside it, right? And then um, and hooked up. The uh, terminal, the positive and negative terminal, uh, we wire it so that it can then um, use, you know, as a uh, USB power supply. Let's see if we can do that. Okay, so I need to drill a hole uh, in this uh, spotlight and find out if I can rewire this spotlight to accommodate this USB uh, port. So it is a uh, 6 volt, 2.5 amp hour battery. Not bad. Okay, so let's test the batteries first to see if it can be hooked up to the um, USB that it, it does actually work. So we're going to put positive. So spread them apart. There we go. Positive and negative. Okay. And then um, plug the charger, the USB charger, to a device that I can test. So I'm going to use this um, compact fluorescent light, the one I bought, uh, I think, at the source or at the uh, Radio Shack. So it's one of those plastic ones that actually has a very tiny fluorescent light tube. Runs on uh, two AA batteries but it can also be plugged into a USB, so that's pretty cool. So I'm gonna use that. Okay, plug the USB in. There we go. All I'm gonna do, it's gonna zoom in here. There, it worked. Okay, perfect. So that's what we're gonna, now we're gonna rewire it so that I can install the uh, USB um, charger into this um, Spotlight. Okay, so you will need a two wires. So one's going to be the positive, and one's going to be the negative. I'm going to solder it then positive in and negative here. Okay. Um, and then I'm going to solder it onto this USB charger. Okay, and I'm going to drill a hole on the um, spotlight where we can just fit snugly into there. Okay into the spotlight. Okay, so let's solder in the wire. I'm also going to install a switch uh, as well to turn off and on the uh, USB power because it's hooked up to the battery and uh, there's no way to turn it off. 
So I need a to get a switch, so I bought this rotary switch. It's the uh, miniature feed through switch. Okay, so I'm gonna try to do that. Take one of the wire and I'm gonna feed it through it, and then we can turn it off and on just by uh, rotating the dial. Okay, as you can see, it's now has a switch off on button. So it's right now the USB charger is on. I can turn it up by switching, twisting the switch. Pretty neat. Okay, and I'm going to cut into the spotlight so I can fit my um, USB charger snugly in there and I can hot glue it. Now make sure you put on your safety glasses when you do this. Okay, because there's a lot of dust particle, plastic particle. Okay, so let's put it together. You can see the switch works. Test it one more time. Here's a second version of my spotlight with a USB connection or uh, outlet. This one is a 6 volt, but it's um, uh, more amp in it, so more power. It's actually a 27 watt uh, spotlight, so you have more juice in this one. Thanks for watching. I hope you can build one too. It's a k2.com.